Since Monday, around 100 NUP supporters have been longing to leave Saza prisons in Masaka where they have been held since they were granted bail by Masaka Chief Magistrate's Court. They had been arrested in Kalangala last week as their presidential candidate Robert Chagulanyi campaigned. Among the charges are participating in activities that can lead to the spread of COVID-19 and inciting violence. The accused prisoners would have been released on Monday when they first appeared in court from police detention but were unable to complete bail obligations. They were then held in prison before things took a different turn as the army eventually took over the prison security. Today's development was a result of two production warrants by the party's lawyers. <laughs> However, en route to court, one of the two buses was diverted. The chief magistrate now wants Saza Prison's boss, Henry Chidega, to show reason why he should not be charged with contempt. Because you have received credible information mm. that the bus carrying them mm. left prisons, mm -hmm. but they are not here about an hour ago. Mm. Of Saza Prison, Mr. Chidega Henry, to explain why he has not brought other prisons. Oh, why he should not be charged for contact of court. At the time of filing this story, the whereabouts of the supporters in the diverted bus were unknown, and all except four of the 40 who were produced in court were released. Uganda Law Society and human rights activist Dr. Livingston Sewanyana condemned the prison service for engaging in what they called an illegality. Yeah, it means that uh, the rule of law is under attack. It means that um, the injustice the freedom, the, the liberty of the accused, of the grantees, remains in jeopardy. So if, if the bail terms were fulfilled, then their right to liberty and security were, were, were granted. It is, it is incumbent upon the state then to release them unconditionally. But at least I know I have a production warrant for today. If I have a production warrant, how can it be illegal? I, I think they, they have sent for a bus from Kampara to take them to court. Because the other time we were ambushed, that's why we used the road in Masaka. But now we have, we have sent a bus to take them to court. They also condemned the army's role as one of the many examples of militarizing institutions of government. Edward Mhumza, NTV.